guys! Welcome to my channel! Today, it's 2.20pm uh, and I'm going to make a salsa and I would like to show that to you, okay? So, welcome to my channel again! It's Phil Am Couple, Simply Us, and Happy Life. This is just a simple salsa. So, I do have a uh, tomato for this one, guys. Fresh tomatoes. And I also have the jalapenos. Okay, let me adjust my camera, okay? Oops. Okay. So, first of all, I'm going to heat up this uh, pan. It's so hot now, so I'm going to put a little bit of um, butter. Just a little bit butter, guys. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. And I also going to uh, put the um, olive oil. Just a little bit of olive oil. Just to add a little bit of taste on it. Would you look at that. Mm. And because it's hot now, so I'm going to put my jalapenos here. Just going wild. Ah! You need a, a cover for that. Hold on. <laughs> you gotta watch it, it's gonna blow. Well, actually, guys, you can grill the jalapenos and the tomatoes on the grill pan. Um, it's so hot, that's why it's kind of. Um, hold on. It's, it's difficult to put it inside of the pan. So you have to be careful. You don't want to burn yourself. So, I'll put this here. And I'll just slow down the, put it in a medium fire. So, just be careful. Um, so I'll grill this for like about, um, 10 minutes or probably 6 minutes and then I'll show it to you guys turn around and then I'll show you the process of making the salsa actually guys um, it's better to uh, make your own salsa because there's a lot of benefits on making your salsa instead of buying in grocery store why I say, why I say that because first if you make your own salsa you control the ingredients. You control the soju. For this one, guys, I'm not going to put any salt, okay? This is going to be jalapenos, um, tomatoes, and whatever the sauce or the juice from the for uh, staying or grilling this will be added on making my salsa. And you know what, guys? Making salsa... Like I said, the benefits for that is it will help you hydrating, helps you to have a good healthy heart, helps you to have, um, like helping your skin to have more good collagen, produce more collagen, and also it's a vitamin E and vitamin C that uh, protects the nu nutrients or give a protein to your skin and your body and your system also. So it's very, very good to make your own salsa instead of buying it on grocery store. But if you don't have time, because you're probably busy working or doing or taking care of your kids or your husband, or if you have a dog, of course you don't have time of doing that. Um, you can buy in gro grocery store, but you have to see or check the contents of the salsa because some of them have many... Uh, soju that is not very good for your health and soju is not good because you will get fat and for this salsa it's um, it's good that you have your own salsa because it will lessen your fats also because of the spiciness that the jalapenos have already okay so right now I'm cooking the jalapenos I don't know how you pronounce the jalapenos. I pronounce it jalapenos or jalapeno. But 
but I'm Jalapenos is how I say it, okay? So I'll just I'm just gonna turn this over, but you have to be careful. <laughs> you don't wanna hurt yourself. This is the hard part in uh, grilling this uh, jalapenos or the tomato. Sorry guys, I'm not very good. I'm trying my best. <laughs> Oh, you're perfect. Oh, you're perfect. So, yeah, I make my own salsa. We make our own salsa because it's good every time we eat, um, like, maybe uh, fried fish. You just put it on the side or uh, pork or beef. Put it on the side. It's very good. So, there's a lot of benefits for this, guys. So, uh, for the meantime, I'm going to wait for this, guys, to cook. I'd like to burn it a little bit so there's a smoky taste on it when I combine all together and I'll show you the process of making my salsa. It's very simple and it will not cost you a lot and um, it will save you a lot also. This will probably, if I make this salsa for four pieces of jalapenos and two pieces of tomatoes right size, it will probably take like about two to three days for us and I just put it on a refrigerator so I'll just wait for a moment and show you the process of this guy it's very simple so I'll see you later I'll be back guys I'm back again so the jalapenos and the onions sorry the tomato is already cooked I grilled them like I said it's uh, five to uh, ten minutes so all of them are grilled so this will be look like this I burn a little bit because like I said I like a smoky taste on my salsa so what I'm going to do guys is to show you the process of making my own salsa so since that is cooked already I will use um, a blender and I will put the salsa oh I will put the jalapenos and the tomato here so I just put it here one by one okay um, let me uh, hold on guys, okay? So, because there's a, maybe, well, you can, you can use this, put it here in the blender, but I tried to uh, remove that because it's hard to eat that and I don't think that uh, it will be good for the blend blender so let's just cut that it's hot guys so I just hold it on the tip so put it there put it all together all together there and then like I said I said a while ago the juice you can see the juice it's a little bit of juice from the olive oil and the butter so we're going to put that here also and that way we could have a little bit of um, taste of that juice Okay. 
All right. Um, it's hot. Now, I'm going to put the pepper because I want a taste of pepper. So this will be spicy because of the four jalapenos. So I'd like to put a lot of peppers because I'm I like you know eating and taste more the pepper. And then I have the basils that I'm going to put like a pinch. A pinch of basil. Let's put another pinch of that. Now, if you will notice, I did not put the um, the salt for this because I don't want the soju. I always remove the, so the soju every time I eat something. And you can avoid the, so the soju, guys. So you just have to know how to do it. And speaking of that, I have this coming from my husband. He gave this to me. And it says... 366 low fat brand name recipe in minutes. So I'm going to use that. I will get some recipe for that and show it to you. This is healthy stuff. And because uh, we don't want to get so fat, we don't want to get sick, we don't want to, you know, uh, uh, ignore our health. So we have to take care of our health. So doing this is very good because. Um, like I said a while ago, having a salsa, making your own salsa will benefit will benefits you a lot. This is good for uh, cholesterol also. And this is good also if you have a problem with your blood sugar or if you have problem with your sugar level in your body, this is going to be okay for you. So, um, this one here guys. I'm not going to put any water on this one, okay? So, let's just put that in the blender and put that here and I'm going to show you okay now I'm ready many though but this is will be enough for one to two days or probably three days so I can feel actually not I can feel I can smell the the taste and the smell of jalapeno with the tomato so I'll another blend again this is pure tomato and jalapenos guys and I didn't put anything like I said that's why it's very important to know what's the contents of your food or even your salsa oh my god ah goodness gracious It's yummy. So um, let's remove this and put it on the container. I don't know if you can see better because the camera is a little bit away from me. Um, I'm trying to go. I'm trying to find a good angle for this one, guy, But this is all I can do. Okay. 
We're getting better every day, okay? Let's get more. Don't want to waste every pieces or every bit of this jalapeno and tomatoes. The tomatoes. Tomatoes are not very expensive in U.S., but in the Philippines, it's very expensive, and even jalapenos. Um, so this is gonna be look like. So it's not plenty, guys, but this will be okay, because this will be enough, and I can make more some other time. And I will just let it cool because it's hot. It's still, uh, it's hot. I don't want to cover because I don't want to spoil my jalapenos. But it will not be easily spoiled, okay? Even if you cover it quickly. But I just don't want, I, would just, I just want to let it cool first before I cover and put it in the refrigerator. Now, this one, I can put this on the crackers, okay? Like this one here, guys. Hold on. Okay, this crackers here, like this is also good for diet. So for some of you there that um, looking for a right uh, diet, don't spend too much. Just buy the crackers like this and make your own jalapenos and you can use this and put it on top of, of your crackers. And that will be a good diet and just drink uh, water or hot tea or coffee also. A coffee is not really bad if you are um, controlling the coffee and um, not too much of coffee is not really uh, not bad. You just have to control the limits of what are you using or the limits of your drinking of coffee. So it will be all right. And it's also coffee is antioxidant also. Just drink coffee, um, moderation, just right. Don't over overdo or don't overuse the coffee. You'll be all right. And there you go, guys. This is my salsa. It's very simple. It's not going to cost me a lot. I spent just like about $2 for all of this. And um, saves me a lot again. So, like I said, guys, it's very important to save money every day, every single day of your life. And um it's better to be wise and smart in everything you do when it comes to cooking uh doing something uh buying something traveling save more and be smart and be wise okay so i will let you go guys and i hope you like my cooking uh not cooking really my style of cooking or making my own salsa and i hope you um you learned something from this and if you want the recipe for this, please don't hesitate to check my channel. I will put the description down below. And um, there's more that I would like to share with you about cooking, about traveling, about motorcycle, about budgeting, about the house, um, housekeeping and cleaning, household chores, a lot, guys. And I'm happy to uh, show that to you on my own little way to help you out if you have a struggle in those things or in those areas okay so guys like i always said life is good life is beautiful so always keep smiling and enjoy your life everyone so thank you for watching and always subscribe like views and comments it's still on couple simply us and happy life thank you so much guys we really appreciate you god bless bye